everybody welcome back to the cabin I want to answer a question that I get literally every single day and that is what pants do I recommend my answer to that has changed over the last uh, three years or four years since I started this um, this lifestyle permanent or full-time lifestyle actually I'm gonna go in front of the cabin because it's kind of windy here Hold on. okay that's better yeah the question I get is what pants do I recommend what pants am I wearing in my videos? Um, a lot of the times over the last three and a half years you've seen me wear primarily, especially in the uh, shoulder seasons and winter, uh, those Fjall Raven Vita Pro and Fjall Raven Kebs I think are the other ones. Uh, one of them has the zippers in the sides and thinner material in the hot zones to let uh, heat escape and I find those pretty comfortable in the summer. And then the other ones are, are more uh, solid and heavy and when you wax them they are quite warm, too hot for me for most, most of the time, except for this time of year and later. Uh, but first of all, a couple of problems with them, I don't like the price and I don't think they're as durable as they should be for the price. Um, so, so this year I've been switching sort of back to just the Columbia type pants, like the zip off uh, lightweight pants for the summer that dry really quickly. I don't overheat in them first of all and then when I do uh, get them wet they dry pretty quickly and uh, I find those pretty comfortable for the summertime. Um, I found these pants during the summer, in the summer, online and I ordered a pair sight unseen and never had worn this type of, this brand of pant and I'd never um, ordered pants online without being able to try them on so I wasn't sure how the sizing was going to work anyway it's, they're Carhartt I'm not affiliated with Carhartt at all I've never even talked to them they have no idea that I'm wearing these pants and it's probably going to stay that way um, I just was looking for a pair of rugged pants I was tired of paying overpaying for those uh, Fjall Raven pants and then wearing them out and uh, just looking for something more durable and something more comfortable so I ordered these online. The reason I got these ones in particular, um, I think Carhartt just has a lot of like canvas type pants, like denim type pants, uh, and good work clothes. I probably actually I think I have a coat from them. Um, but anyway, they're known as durable work products or work uh, clothing, and that's fine. But I wanted something that maybe could dry a little bit quicker or be a little bit more durable. So I looked these ones up, and they are called. I have to look on the inside of the pocket for a second because <laughs> it's actually on the uh, inside of the pocket printed there. Rugged Flex Steel Cargo Pant Relax Fit. So I started, I tried to wear these in the summer and they were way too hot on me. Um, so any cool days, late summer and early fall, I've been wearing them. And I am really, really happy. I'm finding them much more durable. I've been wearing them, doing them, so, uh, wearing them, doing some heavy work, some very abrasive work, walking through the bush, hunting, uh, kneeling in a canoe, uh, cement work, uh, tree work, um, cutting of logs, carrying of logs, all that kind of stuff. The cellar. So I've been wearing them long enough that I'm happy enough to recommend them if anybody's interested in, in a durable pair of pants. It's still expensive compared to like a, just a regular blue jean, but I think the features make them worthwhile. Um, there are cargo pants that are full of full of good pockets, handy pockets. I like the fact that they actually have hip pockets on the back as well, which the other ones, uh, other brand doesn't have. It's got a loop for like a hammer loop, another one here for some kind of tool, a deep pocket for the cell phone. Although I'll show you something that I didn't like about it, and it actually cost me a thousand dollar cell phone that I dropped into the lake when I was hunting and fishing with the guys. Uh, they're very flexible and they have reinforcement in the uh, places that are going to wear out so that's why I like them so much and they're extremely comfortable most comfortable pant pair of pants I think I've ever worn actually so that's these that's the pants that I'm wearing now and I'm wearing them almost every day and I'll continue to do that in fact I'll probably end up ordering another pair and I'll look to see if they have any lighter versions of something like this rather than just heavy uh, canvas so um, I'll provide a link in the description below the video of where I ordered them from Carhartt. I don't know if there's an Amazon link. If there is, I'll put it in there. 
and I would get like 50 cents from your purchase if you do go that route. I don't think there is though. Um, well, I guess just quickly, if you're looking at what else I'm wearing and wondering at the same time, this shirt is just a heavy fleece uh, button-up shirt from Outback Trading Company from the U.S. It's, uh, I like wearing it at this time of year. It's not it's not too warm, although if I went for a long hike, um, I'd probably have to open it right up, but at least I can do that to vent it. Uh, otherwise, it's been fairly durable. I've been wearing it since last year. problem with fleece, though is that it will burn if I get an ember on there which is not ideal so for that reason I usually prefer to wear wool but that's what that is this is my Outback hat which is not affiliated it's the model Outback from Tilly and it's waxed canvas and I waxed it heavily myself and oil it so it's waterproof and that's yeah that's what I'm wearing today I care anyway I'm gonna uh, get uh, back to work here but if you're interested in this kind of video, I have a video playlist um, over here in the bottom left hand side of your screen called This or That. And if you're interested in seeing uh, just what's happening this year, 2020 at the cabin, then this uh, playlist in the upper left hand corner of your screen is, is that. So thanks for watching, I appreciate it, and I look forward to seeing you at the cabin next time. Take care.